With projects animations over 50 to 60 frames, when it goes to render, it's best to stay with the default PNG format at the start. This way, if you want a break or an error occur, you can adjust that without losing time. You will end up with a PNG sequence like this one, which runs easily as a video on multiple programs. Like in After Effect, you just need one click, the import button. However, in Blender, there's a couple of things to pay attention to. First, switch any work window to a video sequencer. Then make sure you set on frame one, cause Blender imports on the frame you're standing on. This area in the sequencer define the same timeline we have at the bottom, so check the frames you rendered to match it with the timeline. Like in my case, the last 10 frames are still, I cut them from the render, and I can edit it later, so I will match the timeline last frame to 150 as my render. Now you should go to the Add, choose Image Sequence, and select the folder where you output the PNG, then import it. A thing to pay attention to here is the frame's order, cause sometimes it starts from the last, so you end up with reversed animation to what you want. Thus make sure when you're done importing the image sequence, the first frame name show up on it. Now we can fix the output settings for video, and there are many options. The one I go by is the last option in the file format. Then put the encoding on MPEG-4 and the quality on best or lossless and hit render animation. It's happening! Everybody stay calm! What's the procedure? Stay calm! What's the procedure? Stay calm! This is a beginner error. Video sequencer don't work when the render region is on, so try not to use it and depend on the camera pass part out, which is easier, but I think the region option do cut from data usage more. I don't know, so pay attention to that if you're going to use it. That's it. Now all those frames will assemble together and make a video just like the Avengers, the ones who assembled 14 million times against Thanos, won once, and made a movie about it. Stay sharp, guys. Goodbye.